Welcome! This video is to instruct the user how to use the Scheduling Genie in MPA Works. This feature helps with assisting with your scheduling process. There are three portions to the Scheduling Genie, creating attributes, assigning them to staff members, then using the Genie for a client. To get started, first select the Edit button located on the top toolbar of your MPA Works main screen. In the Edit drop-down menu, select Scheduling Genie Attributes. The Scheduling Genie Attributes window will be displayed. Attributes are used to identify the needs of your agency's clients. To add an attribute, click on the Add Attribute button located on the right of the window. A blank attribute will be added to your list of attributes. First, select the attribute sentence by selecting Can has, or is from the drop-down menu. Next, enter the attribute in the attribute name field. Once these have been completed, you can enter a shortened version of the attribute name in the short name field for organizational purposes. To edit an existing attribute, click on the edit icon located on the top right of the window. A message will be displayed warning you that all profiles will be updated for any edited or deleted attributes. Click Cancel to return to the Scheduling Genie attribute screen. Click OK to be able to edit your attributes. Any existing attribute can be edited by choosing a new verb from the drop-down list or by typing in the Attributes field. If you wish to delete an attribute, click the X button located to the left of the attribute. Please note that editing or deleting attributes will result in the attribute being updated or removed from all client and staff profiles that it has been previously used on. Once all attributes have been set, click the Save button located on the bottom right of the window. Let's now assign the attributes to a staff member. On your MPA Works main screen, select Staff located on the left of the screen. The staff list will be displayed. Highlight the staff you wish to assign attributes to. Then select the Scheduling Genie icon located on the top toolbar. The Scheduling Genie Staff Attributes window will open. To give a staff member an attribute, click on the toggle button. An attribute can be deselected by clicking on the toggle button one more time. For the language attributes, use the drop-down menu to select the specific language the staff speaks. If a new attribute has been added, you will see a new label to the left of the attribute. Please note that when a new attribute is added, it must be selected for each staff member you wish to use it for. Lastly, to fully use the Scheduling Genie, the staff availability will need to be set. This can be done by simply clicking on the Update Availability button, which will open the staff member schedule. Click Save to save your work and close the window. Now that attributes have been created and set for the staff member, we can move forward to using the Scheduling Genie for a client. Select Clients on your MPA Works main screen. Then highlight the client's name you wish to use the Scheduling Genie for. Click on the Scheduling Genie icon located on the top toolbar. The Scheduling Genie window will be displayed. Click on the Update Availability button to open the client's schedule to add or update the availability. Note, the client's availability needs to be set in order to generate an accurate result. On the Attributes section of the Scheduling Genie, click each attribute's toggle that fit the needs of the client. For the language attributes, use the drop-down menus to select the languages that the client speaks. Select the required checkbox to the right of the attribute if there is an attribute that a staff member must have. For any newly added attributes, you will see a new label to the left of the attribute. Please note, when a new attribute is added, it must be selected for each client in order for it to be used. After the attributes have been chosen, move on to the Find Matching Staff section of the Scheduling Genie. In the Service Needed field, use the drop-down menu to select the service that the client needs a staff member to complete. In the Staff Located Within field, enter the miles for the distance to be calculated from the client's default service location and the staff's home address. Please note, 
The distance will be calculated in a straight line between the two locations. The search dates from line will allow you to search for a staff in a specific time period. Use the mini calendars located next to the dates to select a specific beginning and end date. Otherwise, these fields will be defaulted to display the current date and the final day of the contract. If you wish for the scheduling genie to also search for staff that are inactive, have incomplete credentials, or have expired credentials, then click their corresponding toggle. Once the Find Matching Staff criteria has been set, click the Search button. Now the results of the search will be displayed. The staff members that most closely match that client's attributes and their matching criteria will be listed first. To increase the size of the Results tab, you can click on the Maximize button located in the right corner of the screen. The results will show the staff member's name, availability percent, miles from the client, and the attributes fulfilled by the staff. Click on the Expand button to see the extended results for all attribute columns. If you wish to hide the columns, click on the button again. The number of result pages and items per page will be displayed at the bottom. To export the results page to Excel, click the Export button in the bottom left of the page. You can compare a client's availability to more than one staff member. To do this, click on the selection box next to each staff member's name, then click on the Compare Availability button. The Compare Availability window will be displayed. The window will display the time of day, the date range, and the individual days within the date range. In the main area of the window, the client's availability will be displayed first, followed by each staff member that has been selected. This way you can visually analyze how best to schedule the client with the chosen staff members. Click the Back button located on the bottom right to return to the Scheduling Genie. Lastly, to save the client's attributes, their matching criteria, and to close the window, simply click Save in the lower right corner of the Scheduling Genie. If you have any questions about using the Scheduling Genie, please contact our support team via email at support at codemetro.com or at 877-796-9883. Shh. <laughs>